How's it going viewers? Thank you guys for watching my video. In this video I'll be showing you guys how to turn on the fingerprint password, um, how to turn it on and also if you want to remove your fingerprint um, get that all cleared off I will also be doing that and I'm demonstrating on the Samsung Galaxy S5. So just to get started here if you guys don't know what a fingerprint password is it's a little there's a sensor here on the home button that detects your finger when you slide over like that it will unlock the phone so you can get into the phone easier instead of typing in a password. So just to show you guys here, there is no password here, just a regular swipe to get to your home screen. Um, what you want to do to set your fingerprint is go into your settings. I go by selecting apps and hitting settings. From here, scroll down till you find the fingerprint. Well, there it is, the fingerprint. Go ahead and select that. And from here, you're going to have to register your fingerprint. It gives you a little disclaimer. You guys can read it if you want. I'm just going to go ahead and hit OK. At this point, all you want, all you're gonna do is lay your finger flat and swipe it eight times. You want to do it nice and slow so the sensor can pick up all of the the fingerprint. Uh, and then here at this point, it's done with your fingerprint. It's registered. It. You can register another one or select done. It asks for an alternative password just in case you are not able to get into your phone. I'm gonna do a one 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 four ones. Um, just because it asks for a letter and at least four numbers and it says your finger has uh, fingerprint has been registered tap OK to set the fingerprint as the screen password I'm gonna go ahead and hit OK and as you guys can see the screen lock secured with fingerprint so I'm gonna go ahead and demonstrate for you guys how that works so as you guys can see when I just hit the power button here there is the little finger fingerprint swipe option swipe slower and there you go I am in my phone and the other one if your fingerprint for some reason does not work is the alternative password and that is the one that we typed in a one 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 and that also will get you in a little bit slower as you guys can see but that also gets the trick done um, the second half of my video, I'm going to show you guys how to turn it off and clear the fingerprint off the phone. What you want to do is go to Apps and into Settings and back to the fingerprint. Once you are here, go to the Screen Lock and it will ask for your password, which is your fingerprint, so it's recognized. And this is the kind of uh, screen lock that you want. There's the swipe, which is a regular a pattern to where you drag your finger over a pattern. Um, there's the pin gives you four numbers you can put it in um, there's a high security password the fingerprint and none if you do none if you accidentally hit the button it will automatically go in so you can be uh, pocket calling people so I'm just gonna go back to the swipe and that's just gonna be the regular when you hit the power button you're gonna have to just swipe it to get in um, and then as you guys can see there's one fingerprint registered what you want to do is go into there use the fingerprint to get in and from here you have the option to remove your fingerprint so I'm going to go ahead and deregister and there's a select all or fingerprint one I'm just going to go ahead and hit select all you can store up to three different fingerprints so just to keep that in mind and I hit done one fingerprint will be deregistered OK and there you can see, as you can see you can register up to three fingerprints I don't want to register any fingerprints so no fingerprints are registered and we are back to just a regular swipe screen for getting into the phone just like that set it back to what it was before so that is how you set the pass the fingerprint password on a Samsung Galaxy S5 if you guys have any comments questions or concerns go ahead and put them in the comment section below if you found this video helpful you liked it give me a thumbs up uh, if there's something I can improve on comment section below uh, thank you guys for watching this video have a nice day